All right, let's get this party started. So I like to call this the Red Room. So this is the area after you've completed the, junk, uh, the jumping puzzle. And so let me lay out the map for you. So we jump down and immediately behind us is going to be the first geyser. To the right against this tree is the second geyser. And like immediately in front of us, just about where I'm standing is the light ball I was talking about. And then there's one right here. And then there's one up here. Uh, pretty much where I'm standing, so you can shoot it from down here, of course. And that's the blight ball. Uh, so this is the left blight bubble in the triangle, so the left corner. So this one right here. So this is where the first two people are going to go after clearing the blight balls and clear the ads. And then they'll move to the second blight bubble. Uh, this is the right corner. Did I call that one the left? Yeah, that's the left corner. Uh, where we are is the right corner, the bite bubble here, and there are ads in here. Um, and as you can see, the bridge area that, as Scrib calls it, is where the first knight is. And this platform area is where the second knight is, and he'll have ads on him. Uh, on this alcove slash platform is the first um, uh, sniper. And then there's a sniper here. So while the first two are moving to left and right, um, this is where the sniper is going to come. He comes under here, comes, snipes, snipes, pops super, climbs up here, kills the um, knight, comes down here, gets in the bubble and clears the ad so he's not getting attacked by the other knight. The other two, uh, I think someone should come up here in this alcove because you can hide. And from here, you get a pretty clean shots at the knight and his minions. Uh, the other individual can either hang out up here or they can be down here. Again, once again, but I think the top works better because you have a better field of view. And that will clear the room. Okay, so that's room number one. Room number two. They spawn about here and here. So that's where a script's going to pop her super and we're going to help murderize these guys. And that clears room number two. Room number three, we're going to have a knight here. And there's going to be one right here along with two uh, red bar but uh, void shielded uh, minions. There's going to be a uh, witch right about here. There's going to be a knight right here. Uh, there's going to be a sniper either here or here, and there's going to be one on the left side either here or on the other side over here. So this is the hole I was talking about. By the way, so there's the other uh, knight. So that's the second platform. The first one is up on that little platform in there, alcove, and the other one is right here. Uh, so that's two knights. Uh, again, the first one there, so that's three knights total. The witch here. There's going to be one navigating these stairs. And then there's one who's here. So she hangs out in the bite ball and she's here. So we can use this tunnel to attack the witch and get away and hide, etc., etc. Okay. So um, then we come through here. There's going to be a sniper here, sniper here, sniper here. And once we come through far enough, it's going to spawn two phalanxes, and they spawn right here, and there's a bite ball. I'm sorry, a blight bubble right here. There's also a bite bubble right there, but we want to get rid of those guys and use the blight bubble as a way to escape their attacks. Now, I don't have a clean strategy for this room yet, other than that for this, whoever is doing the sniping job, uh, as best as they can, like what I would do is I'd come here, I'd pop my shield, I'd snipe number one, I'd snipe number two, um, and then I'd work to take down the shield of the uh, witches so the third super can get popped and clear the witches. But well, we'll tweak that as we go. So again, the fourth room, there's really nothing special to say about the fourth room. Other than we have to clear all the blights 
and all the yellow bar enemies in order for the bosses to spawn. And then we retreat to this area where we'll just snipe, 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 whatever. Just back here sniping and dodging void bolts and uh, the little ball charges. And, you know, that's the gist of the layout of the map. Thank you.